Throughout these past years, we've seen rumored hackers within the community such as 1X, John Doe, as well as many others. Most of these supposed hackers were proven to be fake and nothing more than your average exploiter. Now you might think exploiter and hacker are the same thing, but within the Roblox community, there's a clear difference. An exploiter is someone who's found a weak spot in a Roblox game, usually. They exploit the weakness in a game's software, and maybe sometimes you see them flying around in a server, or just thrashing a server altogether. But, exploiters aren't necessarily dangerous. Actual hackers, on the other hand, can be a threat. Hackers are people who break into things rather than exploiting the already existing problems. An example of a hacker would maybe be hacking into someone's Roblox account. So the question is, are these recent hackers actually hacking or are they just exploiting? TikTok is a popular social media platform for users to create and produce short videos that can be shown to an incredibly large audience in a short amount of time. This also means rumors spread like wildfire within the Roblox community, especially rumors about Roblox hackers. This all infamously started with Jenna. Jenna is the most famous hacker we've seen yet thanks to TikTok. We've seen countless videos about this scary hacker who even gave us specific dates of when people were going to get hacked. Even worse, she had a specific target in mind, the girls of Roblox. Obviously, this scared hundreds and thousands of Roblox players, and a lot of them truly believed they were going to be her next victim. Many even dressed up as boys to trick Jenna into leaving them alone. Famous YouTuber Creecraft, with over 4 million subscribers, even hyped up the rumors with Jenna, and more or less confirmed how dangerous this hacker was to susceptible Roblox players. I even made a few videos about her as well, because to how ridiculous the rumors were. What's funny about this whole situation is it wasn't intentional at all. Jenna was made for a Roblox movie on YouTube not to become a hacker. People just started making videos on TikTok and, well, the word just got around. Now, this wouldn't be the first time this has happened, nor will it be the last. Her success even inspired old hackers to come back, such as Tubers93. Other notable hackers were Director Vivian and Unseen Bones. Unseen Bone is the most current hacker who's notable because of the fact he's the opposite of Jenna. While both Unseen Bones and Jenna originated from TikTok, their targets were quite different. Unseen Bones was after the boys of TikTok instead of the girls. He did manage to scare everyone quite a bit because similarly to Jenna, he had a specific hacking date, April 10th. This caused a lot of panic within the Roblox community, but it was so obviously fake. When the day finally came, Unseen Bones just rickrolled everyone instead of the supposed hacking, proving that these hackers cannot be taken seriously. Now, if we look at Unseen Bone's account, we can see it says, I tricked you onto thinking this was a joke. You believed it. Now you know. This is him trying to backtrack that he just rickrolled everyone. Looks like he has a friend. Son's Bones. They broke our window and robbed us. My father's plans to get revenge. So this is Unseen Bone's kid. Who's his wife? Is it Jenna? That would be interesting. That would be some good lore, actually if it was Jenna. He's got on a glass shirt. Interesting, huh? And now we're looking at the Unseen Bones group. And by the way, yes, I am marked as a target. I don't know. I guess he doesn't like me because I made a video about him. And look at me. I'm still fine. I'm not hacked. But he now he has like a YouTube channel. This is it. Yep. Just a lot of beeping. Snappy says, I just found out what the Morse code says in my new video. Okay, credit to Snappy who figured out what the Morse code said. But it says, they all think I'm fake. But wait until April 30th. That's where the fun begins. There will be no more friends and you will something no limbs. I don't know. He's trying to rhyme. He's trying to be Dr. Seuss. I don't know what's going on with that. In the description of the group, it says, my mission is to take over Roblox. Scammers are everywhere. I was a victim. I lost all my limiteds. I will continue until the male who scammed me gets hacked. The thing I don't understand is if you're a hacker, then why don't you hack the person who uh scammed you? Duh. Unseen bones is stupid. Stupid. Like, why can't Unseen Bones hack the person who scammed him? That doesn't make sense. But let's see his game. It's called The Bones Family. He's been updating it. He's been changing it. So let's see. Whoa, whoa. The Bones Family. What's going on? There's some bones? Oh, great. Who's this? Is that Creecraft? Oh, he's dead. There's another dead person right there. And I really hope that's not me. Oh, yep, that's me. If you guys didn't know, uh, Unseen Bones put me in his game before. And here is my Roblox avatar, Dead on the floor. I guess he doesn't like me. I'm on his hit list. I hear shooting. 
What is that? This is supposed to be Dennis, but his cat's just in there. Question mark? This is so weird. Now there's a fire. This is scary. <laughs> Screaming. Oh my god. John Doe is now in here. Hello, John Doe. April 10th hack button. This did nothing. No longer works. Yep. You are not ready. You are not ready. You are not ready. Oh, okay. See, this is where I was. But now I'm like dead over there. But yeah, I don't really know what's going on with Unseen Bones. What's the deal with that? But now there's a new hacker that's following the same formula as Jenna and Unseen Bones. We got some more TikToks, guys. Let's watch. There's a new hacker. On new hacker. Okay. Atroja. So new. So as I Atroza? Atroza is a friend from Unseen Bones. Atroza made a game called Central. He's got a game. Oh, whoa, that's surprising. What an original concept. I found one room with famous Roblox YouTubers slash TikTokers, which are okay. probably his target. So his targets are famous YouTubers and TikTokers. I wonder why. Is it because they can easily give you attention? All right, let's go check out his account. Okay, here he is. Wow, he looks different from the TikTok video we just saw. Look at his about, guys. Becoming a Roblox myth. Right off the bat, you already know it's fake. He's admitting that he's trying to become a myth and of course this man has a group he always gotta have a group he said welcome and he has a game called hisk look at the dislike ratio <laughs> everyone hates it oh my god it's so ominous oh wait sorry i'm in my like furry outfit um ignore that i can't go over here hello that's strange it's so empty i think he must have updated his game because in that tiktok it said there's like a whole group of people who he wants to hack so but i'm seeing a room over here what does this room have it's all crossed out a radio and a bed i would love to sleep in this bed it looks very comfortable and cozy very strange to me these hacker games just seem like they get the best of people's curiosity you're curious you want to join these games you want to see if they'll actually hack you at the end of the day they don't it's just a story to scare people oh i'm trying to press exit and it literally won't let me if you press the exit button you can't pull up the menu you just rejoin the game that's a little spooky it won't let you leave a uh, little does he know i press f11 and i press the exit let me exit it won't let me exit. Oh my god. That was a little spooky. That was a little spooky. Probably gonna scare some people, especially on mobile. It is a little fun, though, to see all these hacker groups, but all of a sudden, we're just seeing so many being thrown at us. But what's the intention behind making these fake hackers? I don't really think there's a clear answer, but based on what I know, I take a wild guess and say, attention. This is probably one of the easiest ways to get your game or name seen by thousands of people in the Roblox community. So it makes sense why people people would start rumors about these fake hackers. But anyways, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below and peace.